excited. It is finally holiday season. Um, it's We're into December now. Um, this is definitely my favorite time of the year. I absolutely love, love Christmas. Uh, if you don't celebrate Christmas, just cold weather is fun and this would definitely work for anybody. I celebrate Christmas. I just love it. I love presents. I love giving presents. I like getting things. I love being with my family and we just hang out and we play games and we eat and it's just just a really really fun time of year for me. Um, without any further rambling, um, we're just doing a holiday look today so I try to just jam as much holiday on my face as possible. So I'm using golds and reds and cranberries and I did throw in some green in there also. So I hope that you use it. I hope that it helps you out a little bit for maybe a holiday party or something like that or just for something fun to do. So I will just show you exactly what I've done. Okay, so my camera cut out in the beginning so I didn't actually record the beginning which is so stupid but I'll just show you exactly what I did. Um, I started with this gold pearl from Inglot on just a regular eyeshadow brush and I put it on the first half of my lid and I stopped halfway. And then on the other side of the same brush without cleaning it off I put it in this sparkly red. It's a matte red with gold glitter. Just really fine gold glitter throughout it. And I just pat it right on the second half. And then so it doesn't just look like a straight line between them. I just took the side with the red on it and pulled it towards the gold. And then right over that line I just pulled over, I turned it over to the gold side and pulled it right back. So you can get, see it kind of gives it a soft transition. Okay, now we're caught up. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a blending brush, this is the MAC 217, into this really dark cranberry type color. It's kind of a maroony, whatever. Um, onto the tip of a blending brush and then I'm just going to start on the outside of the red just lightly along that line and I'm going to stop right about where that gold stops and I'm just going to lightly blend it okay now I want to take my Benefit. This is the right. It's just a really light pink type of pencil and you just put it anywhere you want to kind of brighten up all around your eyes. So I'm going to put it right in my tear ducts and underneath my brow bone. And this is also going to kind of act like a little base too for the shadow I put over it. And I'm going to blend that out with a clean finger. So I'm just going to take this color right here, it's a really light creamy yellow and I've cleaned off my blending brush. I'm just going to put that right on top and I'm going to place that right underneath my brow bone. And I'm going to blend that down just so this color kind of blends up to it. And then I'm going to take this sparkly white just on the corner of that same brush and I'm just going to place it right in the tear duct area. And then without wiping the brush, same brush, dipped right back in that light yellow and I'm going to use this to blend up right here. And now to finish off the color of the eyes, just because I kind of feel like getting ridiculously Christmassy right now. Um, I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a green eyeliner. This is from NYX and it's just like a grass green. It's called green. And I'm going to look up and I'm just going to line right along the lower lash line. I'm going to be taking this little tiny brush. It's a crown brush. Um, it's actually a lip brush, but it's pretty firm, so it'll help me smudge it in. And I'm going to take that also into a just grass green. 
and I'm just going to smudge along the lower lash line right where I just put that color. So I don't really want to do a bold eyeliner. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a pencil, a soft pencil. This is my Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes. This is in just plain black. And I'm just going to line my upper lash line and then I'm going to smudge it out. I'm going to take an angled brush right into a matte black shadow and I'm going to use that to smudge out the line that I just made. And it'll also set the eyeliner. And now to finish off the eyes, I'm going to use a black mascara. This is my telescopic, um, just carbon black mascara by L'Oreal. And you can definitely feel free to curl your lashes before you put on the mascara. I just don't. Anyways, I got this as a Lancome gift and it is called a plum. And it's just a darker plummy color than I'm used to, but I've just been loving it. And so I'm just going to take this on a just a regular blush brush um, and just smile right on the apples of my cheeks. Take a little bit bron a little bit of bronzer right underneath my cheekbone. And then here's something I've been using as a highlighter also. It's this Maybelline eyeshadow. It's called Champagne Fizz. It's just a really, really lovely um, pearly champagne color that I've really been liking. Same brush, just right on the side of it and right on top of the cheekbones. For the lips, since I have so much going on in my eyes, I want to keep the, the lips pretty nude, pretty natural. Um, so I'm going to take this, this is a completely, completely nude, like make you look dead when you wear it. Uh, this is the second Lady Gaga lipstick. Um, I, it's Viva Glam Gaga 2. And I'm just going to pat that on my lips. And then I'm going to top that off with um, just some clear gloss. And you can see up close, this is just the glittery, not glittery, shimmery clear gloss from NYX. Okay guys, so that was it. That is my holiday face tutorial. Uh, this is really perfect for holiday parties um, and for just anything that you're doing during the season. I absolutely love these types of colors. I know that a lot of people have an issue with wearing red eyeshadow, but give it a chance. Um, really the key is blending and just to try and keep other colors around it that are not going to make you look like you've been smoking crack or whatever it does to your eyes. Um, so I think that that's it. Happy December to everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you everybody for continuing to support me and I love you guys so much. Um, don't forget to check out my blog at gourmetglitterati.com. Please subscribe for more videos and I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.